Hello, good morning, and welcome back to my channel, Academy Master. Dear students, hope all of you are doing well. And uh, with the previous uh, important question of phase one, class nine, all of you, those who have studied, I hope you have did well because around ninety percent of the questions came from the suggested question in the videos. So hope and pray that this um, second phase important questions for class nine in BSc, uh, same thing will happen. Okay, dear students, uh, before I start the videos, first of all, I would like to request all of you that most of you, you are watching the videos, but uh, you go on without uh, subscribing it. So please, dear students, if you are first time on my channel, don't forget to subscribe to Academy Master and press the bell icon so that in future, whenever I will be uploading a new video, you will get a notifications. Okay, so let's start. So first of all, dear students, I want to tell you that... Um, your phase two exams routine is out your exams will start from date six okay and uh, another thing uh, your blueprint for the uh, phase two examinations and bsc that is also out so in these videos i will be discussing with you the important questions of all the chapters along with the blueprints means how much questions will be coming which which mark questions will be coming from that particular chapters everything will be discussing here okay so let's start so to start with dear students first is chapter 5 so from chapter 5 dear students uh, we will have only one MCQ okay there will be only one MCQ question so in chapter 5 you don't need to study anything just uh, study the MCQ properly okay <clears throat> excuse me so moving on to the next uh, chapter 6 from chapter 6 you will be getting one MCQ questions one three mark questions will be coming which will be or okay means two questions will be there for three marks you have to answer either one okay and total marks contained in chapter six it will be for one mcq and one three mark questions so total marks for this uh, weightage for this chapter will be four marks okay dear students now chapter number six exercise uh, 6.1 you can mark the important question from this uh, chapters question number two eight and five is an important questions you should you must practice okay next exercise um, 6.2 question number four and five is important you should practice it dear students okay then moving on to the next exercise 6.3 question number one question number four question number six question number seven is important as well as question number eight okay i repeat exercise 6.3 question number one four six seven and eight is an important questions here so i hope you have marked it properly okay now let's move on to the next uh, chapters that is chapter number seven so dear students from chapter number seven you will be getting one three mark questions and only one questions will be coming from here that is for three marks and you will be given the options two questions will be given from this chapter you will be given an options to write any one from there okay or questions will be coming from this chapter so let's uh, mark the questions from exercise 7.1 I feel like question number two, question number six, and question number seven must be practiced properly. Okay, it's an important question. Next, moving on to the next exercise, exercise 7.2, question number four, question number five, question number eight, question number nine, and question number ten are important questions that should be practiced from exercise 7.2. Next, moving on to the exercise 7.3. From 7.3, we have only, I, according to my opinion, we have only two important questions. That is question number one and question number four. Next, exercise 7.4, question number two, question number three, question number four. I repeat, exercise 7.4, question number two, question number three, and question number four is an important question, okay? Next, moving on to chapter number 8. So, in chapter number 8, dear students, uh, we have very few questions. 
and uh, from this chapter you will be getting one five mark questions which will be coming as a or also so you must study it properly okay and the questions which will be or in this chapter one questions from chapter 8 will be there and uh, option number a will be from chapter number 8 and option number b will be from chapter number 10 okay got it so this one you have to keep it in mind and practice properly okay dear students so chapter 8 there will be only one five mark question that means this chapter contain five marks so you must practice it thoroughly exercise 8.1 question number one question number two and question number three i repeat exercise 8.1 question number one question number two question number three is an important question next moving on to exercise 8.2 question number one question number two and question number seven are important exercise 8.2 question number one two and seven is important questions next uh, moving on to chapter number nine in chapter number nine dear students you will get one mcq questions from here and one two marks questions will be asked from this chapter i repeat in question number nine uh, sorry chapter number nine you will get one mcq questions and one two mark questions will be asked from this chapter total marks weighted for this chapter is three marks okay so let's mark the questions First exercise 9.2, question number 2, it seems to be important. Next exercise 9.3, question number 1 and 3 is an important question. I repeat exercise 9.2, question number 2 and exercise 9.3, question number 1 and 3 seems to be an important question. Moving on to next, chapter number 10, exercise 10.3. Okay, question number four is important questions. Okay, dear students, so you must practice. Chapter number 10, exercise 10.3, question number four is an important question. Next, exercise 10.4, question number four, again, it's important. Exercise 10.4, question number four. Exercise 10.3, question number four. Another thing which is important from here is exercise 10.5. In exercise 10.5, you will get um, question, uh, the questions which is important from exercise 10.5 is question number 3, 4 and 5. It's important questions. Exercise 10.5, question number 3, 4 and 5 is important. Another thing you have to keep it in mind, dear students, that from this chapter we have a theorem. So theorem number 10.8 is important. I repeat from chapter 10 we have a theorem so theorem number 10.8 is an important theorem you must practice okay then we uh, I will tell you now the blueprint from this chapters in this chapter you will get one MCQ one two mark questions and one five mark questions you will be getting from this chapter okay so let's move on to the next chapter 11 that is construction so from this chapter all of you this chapter you should practice properly it's easy you should all of you should attempt the questions from this chapter 11.2 question number 1 2 and 4 is important questions i repeat exercise 11.2 question number 1 2 and 4 is an important questions next Chapter number um, 14, exercise 14.1, I repeat, chapter 14, exercise 14.1, question number 2, 4 and 9, 2, 4 and 9 is an important question. Next, exercise 14.2, question number 3, 5, 6 and 8 is important questions i repeat exercise 14.2 question number three five six and eight is important question for your body sense <clears throat> next moving on to exercise 14.3 question number two 
question number three, question number five, question number six, and question number seven. It is important. I repeat once again. Fourteen point three. Question number two, question number three, five, six, and seven are important question for your upcoming examinations. From this chapter, dear student, it contains the highest marks. Okay, statistics. It contains the highest marks. Total mark from this chapter will be ten. So, and this chapter is easy also. So, dear students, practice properly. From this chapter, you will get one two mark questions, one three mark questions. and one five mark questions will be asked so very very important and here there will be no option in the five mark question no or only one question will be asked so there is one prepare very well for your examinations okay now moving on to next that is from chapter number 9 one thing i forgot to tell you dear students that theorem number 9.1 and another theorem 6.7 I repeat, theorem number nine point one and theorem number six point seven is important for your board examinations. So please do mark it and practice it properly. It is given in your textbook. I repeat again, theorem number six point seven and theorem number nine point one. It's important. Okay. Now moving on to the last chapter, chapter thirteen. In chapter thirteen, you will have one three mark questions and one five mark questions with or options. Next, in third chapter thirty, uh, the questions which are important, let me highlight you, and you please uh, do mark it properly. Exercise thirteen point one, question number one, two, and four. In exercise thirteen point one, question number one, two, and four is an important questions. Let next moving on, exercise thirteen point two, question number three, nine, and ten is important. I repeat exercise 13.2 question number 3 9 and 10 is an important question next exercise 13.3 I repeat exercise 13.3 question number 5 and 6 is important questions next exercise 13.4 question number 2 5 6 9 is important I repeat Exercise thirteen point four, question number two, five, six, nine is important. Next exercise thirteen point six, question number one and six is important. The uh, exercise thirteen point six, question number one and six is important. Next moving on to exercise thirteen point eight, question number three, seven, eight is important. Again, I repeat. Moving on to exercise thirteen point eight, question number three, seven, and eight is important. So, dear students, here we come to the end of this important questions. Just I want to make one request, and I want to tell to all of you, dear students, I have told you in the last videos also that up to sixty to seventy, eighty percent, ninety percent questions will come from here. But I am not assuring you that hundred percent questions will be coming from here. so i will recommend all of you that uh, first of all you practice these questions which i have given you properly you must practice and go for your examinations okay and beside that also if you are willing to secure like 40 upon 40 in your next phase examinations then you have to practice beside this also you have to practice other things okay dear students so first of all you make sure that you are practicing this question making confirm that you will be passing in maths okay with this uh, questions properly practiced okay and then you can uh, if you are done with this question thoroughly then you can go for other questions as well there is no harm in learning other question as well okay dear students so with this note uh, i will say that here is the end of this videos and in the future whenever any new informations related to your educations nbsc or related to your examination is updated definitely i will be coming up with the updated videos very soon till then dear students don't hesitate to share this videos with your friend as much as you can okay because your friend also should get help who knows they may not know have this uh, facility they may not know about this 
so how they will come to know it is through you only you have to share the videos with your friends if you are finding that it is helpful to you let your friends also take the benefits of it share the videos with your friends with your relatives so that uh, these videos will be uh, viewed by them and they will also get the benefit of these videos and the efforts which i am making if you think my efforts uh, is uh, you know helpful to you then don't forget to uh, no subscribe my channel and share the video and like the videos thank you so much dear students